Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. Last time we explored a little more of Tucson and found a couple of secrets that we left behind before. This time we need to figure out what to do actually. We could take the bus station but I'm not sure how much that'll actually help us. What's this guy doing here? I heard that a gay girl named Paula was kidnapped while helping out at the Polestar Preschool. Oh god, we gotta help her then. If that's the case. Are we doing good? Yeah, we're fine on life and everything. We do have quite a bit of money though, so if I die, that might not be the best thing in the world. So we're gonna have to want to be careful. Peaceful Rest Valley ahead. Proceed through cave. Let's do it then, I guess. So hopefully nothing's gonna kill us in one shot in here. Also more of the music. There's nothing in here which is kind of wigging me out. Not sure how I feel. Oh, here we are. Who are you? Hum de dum dum dum. I'm hunting for mushrooms. I'm going to collect a ton. All right. I'm digging this tune right now. I'm not an enemy. I'm just a regular mole. Would you like? Would you like to know how to survive battles? Sure. You may have noticed that when you have been badly hurt in battle, you may survive a mortal attack and still have H one HP. If this has happened, it's because of your guts. Your survival may depend on your guts level. Also, more guts helps you get more smashing hits. Beyond guts, you should have... Ugh. Sorry. You should have noticed that it takes some time for damage to be taken from you. This is because of the rolling action of your HP meter. Oops, I mean your life. If an enemy deals mortal damage to you, but you defeat all enemies before your life is gone, you survive. This is all I know. Yeah, I was pretty... I was suspecting that one already. But I'm, I'm glad to know that guts is what determines your critical hits. Oh, the bridge is broken down. Cross bridge to Happy Happy Village. Guess we can't do that. Then well, what's up here? Jeez, literally like nothing. There's nothing here. Enemies, nothing. A pencil. For some weird reason, a pencil-shaped iron statue is blocking the path. Um. Okay. Well, I don't think we really have anything to to get rid of that pencil with, so I guess we're done. That's a UFO. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be here yet, so I'm gonna avoid battles for now. I don't know, I guess I might as well get into battle with there's one alone, because that's not the biggest deal. So I guess we'll, if we see another one, we'll fight it. But I don't think we're going to. Nope, not a single one, okay. Well, now we know what's over there. Oh, what? Two of them. Ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I only want one. One at a time, please. Or do they only appear on your way back? Nope, for sure, they're gone. Okay, there's one. We can take this. A sprout thing. A mobile sprout. I was actually right. Okay, well, let's hit it. Tried to use PSI Magnet Alpha. Oh my god, the teddy bear blocked it. I love it. Wait, isn't this one of the things that's on the level... That's on Smash Bros, which I've actually been told is actually from Mother 1, not from Mother 2. I think that's one of the enemies that shows up. But okay, that guy wasn't too powerful, so I guess we're not... I guess we're fine to really attack anything here. Oh, really? Really? Like, across the screen? Jeez, just die. <laughs> okay, well, it's a good thing we used Rockin'. Good night. Ramblin' Mushroom. Yep, they're all done. Look at that. We're gonna get a ton of experience. Like 300. 361. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I love that. I love that PSI move. It's the best. Oh? Hello, this is the Apple Kid. I just finished work on this great invention. Get over here as fast as you can. This thing is so cool. See you soon. Oh, I guess we should go to Apple Kid then. Since he has completed his invention, perhaps this invention will help us get past that pencil. That would be pretty rad if I were to say so myself. So I guess we should go check that out. Jesus Christ, is every single song in this game amazing? I'm pretty sure it is. Also, my voice is about to die out. So I guess this is probably going to be the last episode I record for today. Apple Kid, what do you have for us now? Oh! He's not here. What? Huh. 
Maybe he's over at Orange Kid's house for some ungodly reason? Oh, he's outside of his house now. As a true genius, I'll tell you that he's in Burglin Park looking for you. Okay. Well, thanks, Orange Kid. Looks like they're not like mortal enemies or anything. That's nice to know. Since he's telling us where he's looking for us. Well, I guess this gives us a chance to check out Burglin Park since we haven't been here before. Yo, the boss of Burglin Park is Everdread. He's got ties to burglaries and kidnappings in this area. Ooh, so he might know what happened to Paula. Everdread has always watched over Burglin Park. That's why we don't have to bribe any crooked cops. Cool. Alright, so... Who's, who do you think Berglin is? If I were to guess, this guy. Hey, Mon! You gotta expand your mind and use this stuff creatively. Come on, buy some of my junk. What would you like, Mon? What is this stuff? Defense spray 500? Are you kidding me? Ooh, that's a nice bracelet. Ooh. Ooh, that seems like it'd be really good. For 349, I mean. I don't know, is it good? A scientific Mon may be able to use... Me Make good use of this here thing. Really now. This must be the guy then. Wahaha! Why don't we chat later after we've locked horns? What? Didn't expect this. Uh oh. Uh. Okay. Well. What exactly did Shield do now? Did it reduce, like, all damage? Because it might not be the worst idea to use. I'm just gonna go for a normal bash. 29 damage to the teddy bear. God, this teddy bear is the best. Um, I don't know. I'm not sure how strong of a guy this is. He knitted his brow. Incredible. I'm just going to do a lot of damage really fast. A biting attack. 29 to the teddy bear. This teddy bear is literally the best thing in the world. Mortal damage to the teddy bear. No, my teddy bear. Why must you do this? Oh, it does a lot of more damage to the us than it does to the teddy bear. Please die. Okay, good. He's done. Well, there goes our teddy bear. Saved our life in that one, definitely. Hey, we leveled up. Offense, defense, vitality. Good, we're gonna get a good level up. Oh, so good. So good. Yes, I'm Everdread, boss of Berglin Park. When I jumped off the roof, I twisted my ankle. Anyway, I lost and nothing will change that. You know, you're pretty strong. Yeah, I know that you want to find out a girl, about a girl named Paula. She went off to a secret hideout in Peaceful Rest Valley. A chubby boy and a weird guy in a blue outfit had kidnapped her, though. Hmm. They say they were going to make Paula some sort of human sacrifice. What? Dude, what? <laughs> you know, she might have been gone already. You better hurry. If you save Paula, be sure to come back here, okay? Don't forget. Okay, so it seems like she's in Happy Happy Valley. Oh, jeez. That's pretty bad, though. Human sacrificing is not usually a good thing. Sure, I'll buy an egg. Twelve big ones. Dude, that's not a problem to me. I got an egg! Of course, Everdread isn't a good person, but he's actually quite warm-hearted for a crime boss. For a crime boss. Seasonings to add your food? Huh? What? Nah, I think I'm good here. That's, this sounds like a lot of complicated cooking stuff right here. wonder what would be good. The right condiment makes the dish taste better, while the wrong one makes it taste worse. If a condiment matches the food, you'll get more power than if you ate the food on a plane. So I guess if you put ketchup on a hamburger or something like that. I own an antique shop. No one is buying or selling anything, so I was thinking of selling the for sale sign that sits in front of me. It's only $98. I'm not sure why I would use that for. Hmm. I like to sell my goodies on the street. Sure, flies land on them, but in my opinion it makes... No, that's not how it works. Actually, you are wrong. Lucky Sandwich. He sells skip sandwiches. Can of fruit juice for $4? Ah, uh, no thanks. Although those are pretty much cookies. Hey, why don't you buy the world's greatest ruler? Sure. It's two clams? What does a ruler do? <laughs> Excuse me? Ruler. You can even use this during battle. It can be used many times. What does a ruler do? There's so many items that are confusing me. Some bananas? No, I would not like to buy any bananas. I don't have any room. I'm feeling really out of it because I've been working all night. 
But finally, the pencil eraser is ready. This machine will eradicate... We need that! <laughs> it's incredibly powerful. Just don't use it near a shop that sells pencils. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> That's how we move on. Uh, what can we just get rid of? Uh, oh, we need to get rid of this baseball cap. You know, I'm going to go ahead and sell that at the department store. I'll meet you back here. Oh, something's happening. I, Paula. I am Paula. Can you hear me calling you? Help! Come and help me. Um, I don't know where I am. I can hear water running in the distance. Ness, please help me. Yeah, I may have took a little sleep in the ho hotel after I, that battle with with the dude. So yeah, see you back in the park. Oh, really? Really? Even more? P -p Paula, where are you? It's time for a yummy pizza. I didn't read that. Jesus Christ, so many interludes. Alright, guy. Come on, just give me the pencil eraser to get rid of the... Er That's so stupid. A pencil eraser? Are you serious? I'm, I'm surprised that you just have to... Oh, he'll call us. I'm a mouse. My master, Applekit, has been waiting for you. Oh, that is Applekit! Jeez. Jeez, how did I not put that together? Also enemies. Also magic butterfly that I no longer need now that I just used the hotel. Could have just taken that instead and just healed myself. Jeez. What is that noise? Why is that noise being made? Is it something in here? Is it the receiver phone? Jeez, I don't even know, man. Let's just get going. Alright, well now that we have the pencil eraser, we can now get rid of that pencil that's blocking the path. I guess we're just going to disregard the bottom path out of here, because we don't need to go to three... What is that noise? I can't pinpoint what it is. Another magic butterfly. We have full magic, right? Yeah. Because going to a hotel also fills our magic. Nothing down there. Whatever. Jesus Christ. Alright, so, not sure if we're going to encounter anything on the way there. But, we'll find out. Oh, some sprouts. Alright. Uh, what life am I at? 41? Uh, we need to fix that. Just real quick. Ah, uh, we have hamburgers. Well, I'm not sure why I'm not using them. Go ahead and use both of them. Why not? Just for the full HP? I think that said we had full HP. Yeah. Yeah, we have full HP. 120 and 40. I like how that's so proportional. I love it. It's just 3 over 1. Creepy music once more. So I guess this must have been the running water she was hearing, actually. So it makes sense that she's actually in whatever place. I mean, we knew that already. I'm not even going to get involved with what's down there. So, let's use the pencil eraser. Wait, what? Since when did we have a chicken? <gasps> oh, that's where the... Okay, the egg did that. Okay, interesting. Let's use the pencil eraser. For some reason, weird reason, the iron pencil statue was erased. Incredible. So, we have two paths before us. I think I'm going to check out this way first, which leads to the photographer guy, I guess. Photographer guy. Oh my god, are you serious? Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, now get ready for an instant of memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say, fuzzy pickles. Indeed. We did it. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. I'm sure it will. Jesus Christ. Okay, was that literally the only re- That was. Oh my god. Get out of here, game. Alright, I guess we need to cross the bridge that- What? That's- That's not fair. Territorial Oak? This is attacking 40 points of damage? Excuse you. That is rude. At least we're faster. Oh, that's... this is incredibly rude. Kill it, please. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna take a chance. I'm gonna go ahead and use Recover then. Because screw that mess. Tried Brain Shock Alpha. It did not work. Okay, cool. Can we knock it out now? No, we can't. It's gonna try it again. It did not work. Please keep trying it. Oh my god, why did it go to, get to go first that time? How much HP does this dude have? Oh, of course we missed. Please fail again. This guy's a genius. Oh my god. 
This is stupid. We can take another hit. It burst in- What?! Oh! Jesus Christ, I just started, like, tapping that button, man. Oh my god. Well, that was dangerous. Uh, can we eat the chicken? It ran away as fast- Okay. Okay! I was, I was assuming the chicken would be like a full heal. Well, dang, that hurt. <laughs> Good thing I pressed that button as fast as I could. Oh, it didn't full us heal, fully heal us anymore. Ooh, well, what do you know? I'm gonna go ahead and use life up again because magic butterfly. Sweetness. All right. Well, you know what? I think we're going to stop right there before we encounter any more trees. So, join us next time when we hopefully are able to find Paula, who's been kidnapped, to Happy Happy Valley. So I'll see you all then, and goodbye.